Australian industries are doing it tough, especially small businesses. That's why the Australian government are providing a 100% tax rebate to the industry that's had it tougher than all the rest. That's right, the mainstream media. Because without them, we couldn't f you over. Despite the fact that the mainstream media had a captivated audience who were locked at home for 23 hours a day in front of their telly, they really struggled. Press conference after press conference, they didn't know which one would be their last. The mainstream media need the most help because they've been the most help to the government's propaganda objectives. The $41 million worth of thank you money, I mean, uh, it's not thank you money, but thank you. Honestly, we couldn't have done it without you. Thank you for showing a man punching a horse when that's exactly what he did. That's clear. Thank you for calling tradies white supremacists. Thank you for never showing the good side of protesters. We're giving you $41 million to say thank you for helping to increase the teen cutting rate in a way that emo culture never could. Australians are doing it tough. But just imagine if they didn't have the corporate sponsored media. What would Australia look like without the media? I don't need authorization in Canberra, so go f yourself. Thank you so much to my Patreon supporters, especially Gun Guru, for supporting this video. Now, if you would like a shout out, you should head over to patreon.com forward slash deactivist. You can also join our Discord server and you can share in some pretty dank memes. Do kids still say dank memes? I don't know. Anyway, I'll see you there and make sure you like and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Thank you for cutting away from Daniel Andrews as he answered questions about corruption. Okay, we're going to leave that there because they're just repeatedly asking the Premier questions about the anti-corruption body. Actually, he's talking COVID now. Let's take a listen back in.